Hey guys, what is up? This is AJ170. Now today, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get the ultimate emulator pack, which is ISSP, Providence, and INDS, guys. All of it is actually from Mojo, guys. So before you jump right in, guys, can I get 170 likes, guys? Also, if you're new, support the 170 and subscribe. So with that said, let's go ahead and jump right into the video. So, um, as you see right here, I'm opening up all of my apps and none of them are currently working. That's because I did restart of my device and I'm currently not jailbroken. So, um, as you can see right here, here's Super Smash Bros. And it is currently working. And here's Providence right here and it is currently working. And, uh, here's INDS right here, guys, and it is currently working. So as you can see, so now I'm going to go ahead and delete Super Smash Bros. And we're going to re-download that. This should work from iOS 9.1 or 9.2. I forgot where it starts from all the way to iOS 10.0.0 beta 1. So um, what you're going to want to do before you install it, go ahead go to date, uh, general date and time and turn offset automatic. Don't do anything else. Then go ahead open up Mojo. Again, there should be a link inside of the description to it. Go to sources on the bottom. And you should have a default official mojo, mojo repo. Scroll down until you find the desired app you want. Just about all of them should work with the date trick. So uh, as you see they have a couple of them. Not that many. But uh, go ahead and look for whatever app you want. For me it's going to be ISSB. And a green circle around the icon means that it's signed. If the green circle is not there that means it is not signed guys. So what you're going to do is go ahead scroll down. Look for the install button, click it, wait for the prompt to come up asking you to install. Go ahead, hit install again. And as you guys you can see, it's already downloading. Now you're going to want to go ahead and go to your date and time. Go back all the way back to January something 2012, guys. Oops, didn't mean to do that. I did that almost every single app I installed. So as you see, I went to January 10th. That's the date I like using. So as you see, it's already done downloading. Now it is just installing. Any second now. And it is now done, guys. So if I try opening it now, it'll actually say untrusted enterprise developer. So go ahead, go into the settings, turn on automatic again. You have to do that. Then go to device, profile and device management, scroll down and start looking for which enterprise apps it is that actually has Super Smash Bros. Go ahead hit verify app or trust enterprise developer. Then once that is done, hit the home button, go to the app and then now you can see it actually fully works guys. So uh, yeah again, uh, like I said, this is probably the perfect emulator pack guys. But uh, yeah, this is going to be it, guys. This is AJ170 signing out. See you guys next time.